Yeah, welcome back. Now, what next thing is you have to install the ODK Collect app is on Google Play Store. This is my ODK Collect app. When you open the ODK Collect app, now the first thing you are going to do is you are going to connect the ODK Connect app to the Kobo uh, Toolbox server. Now, what you want to do is just click on Start, uh, click on top here, and click on General Settings. On that General Settings, you have to come to the server. Then, on this URL, when you come to this data collection page here, I are going to select Android application. You will see install Kobo Collect. Now we are using ODK. We also have a Kobo Collect app on Play Store, but now we want to use ODK with Kobo Connect. So this is the where you are going to put this uh, server URL. You see, it's already here. The URL. Uh huh. Then after that. You have to input your username, which I've already put, and you have to put your password also. After doing that, the next thing is you are going to come back to the home page here. Then you are going to click on get blank form. Now it's trying to connect to the server. Now can you see it has shown us the project one that we have deployed here. You see the project one. Uh -huh. Now, what you will see here is that when you click on the app, when you now they say get selected. After getting selected, you see project one has been successfully. Now, we have got the form. Then fill the blank form. When you click on this, fill the blank form. You see the project one. These are the example of the form I already created on the another account. Now click on the project one we create. Can you see what's your first name? If I didn't put anything here and click next, you see, sorry, this red point is required because we click to be a mandatory. Then when you input this one, next, age, next, married, single, next, degree, next, you have to take a photograph or choose image. If you take a photograph, it's going to show you can you see now and if you want to choose a photo too you have to choose an image now then this is the location when you click on start point it will generate the location uh, GPS location of where you are working then you come to this save form and exit now the form has been if you want to edit the form you come here and edit the form then send if after finish capturing now you can send the finalized form then you see send select then project successfully submitted now af after it has been successfully submitted Now, after it has been successfully submitted, you come to summary. Can you see the total number of projects is here? Then what we will do next is you come and check the form, the data you gathered. Can you see it? the names the age then you can come here to to download the data then you click on export after clicking on export here you can see it's processing after processing then it's available now to download then when you download you can choose how you want before you download you can choose how you want your data to be uh, exported now here you can choose either excel analyzer xl any type of format you want now after doing that you can new exports now pending is processing the data now it's available then you click on it 
then it will be downloaded now our data is now available for download now can you see how it works now thank you for watching the tutorial